Good afternoon YouTube. So this is the Chili Warrior trying out his very first video and uh, what I've been doing recently is I've been checking out YouTube. Uh, I've been looking up all the chili tests that people have been doing and as a proper chili head uh, I think they're really great. Uh, so what I thought I'd do is try out my own. Uh, what made me do this actually was uh, I'm spending a year in Germany right now on the exchange program and I was in a German supermarket and I happened to notice this bottle of sauce that I've never noticed in the UK before. It's uh, this here. It's called Hot Mamas Premium Quality Sauces. Number 14, Red Habanero. And what it says on the label is Weltschärfster Chili, fühle den Schmerz, gefährlich scharf, warm hinweise beachten. Which, if I can translate, basically means the world's hottest chili, feel the burn, dangerously hot, and you have been warned. So, a sauce that takes itself seriously. Uh, I also like what it says on the back, uh, which says, avoid eye contact, pretty sound advice. Uh, if you overdose, drink milk, and keep it out of reach of children. So, again, taking itself pretty seriously. Uh, what it also says is, it gives itself a heat rating of 7 out of 10. So, could be good. Yeah, like I said, I've never heard of this brand before, so I did a quick uh, web check. It's, uh, it is a German company, so that's why I've never seen it anywhere else. If you want to have a look, it's at hotmamas.de, all one word. And uh, they seem to have uh, quite a decent range of sauces, so might be worth checking out if you're a bit of a chilly head. Uh, yeah, so nothing really left to do now but give it a try. Like I said, I've never tried this before, so my first try is being shared with you guys. So let's open it up and see what we think. Hmm. Smells quite vinegary. Uh, you can immediately smell that distinctive habanero smell. Smells like it could be hot. The main ingredients are water, habanero chili, honey, and vinegar. Also salt and garlic. Then after that, it's kind of uh, E numbers, basically, and that generic spices. So uh, yeah, based on the habanero. Actually, I understand the habanero isn't the world's hottest chili, despite what it says on the label. But there you go. Yeah. So it smells good. Let's have a look. Got the old spoon here. Let's see. Quite a runny sauce. Kind of reminds me of uh, the Encona sauce. Got a bit runny. Right, here we go. Mm. Instantly starts tingling your tongue. Yeah, pretty hot. Mm -hmm. Goes all the way down the throat. Quite pleasant. Not the hottest thing I've ever tried. Getting a bit of lip tingle now. Mm. Still prickling the tongue a bit. Nice flavour, quite vinegary. But Despite the fact it's got a few E numbers in it, can't really taste them, so that's good. Can't really taste the honey in there, but I'm sure it plays its part. Heat's already fading away, actually. Still feeling it in the throat more than the mouth, I would say. Making the drool come a little bit. Yeah, already starting to fade away. I mean, I think it hits its peak pretty fast. Uh, and then it's starting to, yeah, definitely starting to fade now. Very pleasant though. Yeah, good taste. Mm. Yeah. yeah, definitely going now. I think you could afford, if, if you were eating this with some food, you could afford to use it quite liberally. No reason to hold back with this one. Yeah. Almost gone through my tongue already. Uh, hanging around the throat a little bit. Tiny bit of lip, ting lip tingle remaining. Yeah. 
like I said, reaches its peak very fast. So, that's about it. I think I've described it the best I can. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed my very first chili video. And uh, hopefully I'll be back to do some more tests in the future. Thank you, YouTube.